Here we are in Kerala, India, and this is totally take two because we got incredibly bombarded again as we were doing our first uh, TV episode. But it's better because uh, the lighting wasn't good and the, and the sound quality wasn't good. So take welcome two. back, welcome back to Jolie um, TV. We are now in our uh, cottage hotel in Kerala. The sun is setting behind us, and it's we're the on. The wet. Uh, we're in the witness protection program. Uh, we're on one of the largest lakes, and uh, we're on the uh, west coast of India, and we're having so much fun. But this is quite different from where we were the first 10 days. Yes, it was so different. Um, we had an amazing time. We can't let them know too much because we wanted to see the documentary, but we can't wait for you to um, see the documentary. It's going to be pretty amazing. I think we had a film, well, we'd say a production company with us, with Carmela and she filmed the whole thing, our highs, our lows. Yeah, um, in-betweens. Yeah, so. I would say the majority of the time we were really cold. It was probably like 40 degrees when we were sleeping at night. No heat. The, the bed was a hard board with a very, very, very thin mattress, and that's being generous. And, uh, and we were often We would wake ourselves hungry. up freezing, and I literally lived off cornflakes, um, cucumber, <laughs> and bread. For like uh, it was only ten. It only seemed like ten. It was only ten days, but I was so hungry. Like, and I think when you're hungry, you yeah, get ratty yeah, yeah. and you get exhausted. But we do it all again. Yeah, we would definitely do it again. And I think, you know, the light at the end of the tunnel was just the girls that we got to work with, both the uh, All Indian Football Federation, the women's national team, and the U16 team, and then the girls from UA. They're all so special mm -hmm. and. Uh, considering how little they have in the village of Ua in terms of electricity, just plumbing, they were the happiest kids we've ever seen, and they were always smiling. They yeah. never got tired. They just they kept us going. We were like, day in you tired? Out. They're like, no, no, ma'am. <laughs> They're so cute. But um, we would run them through two a days with all the great bibs and the great cones and the speed ladders that all your money helped to buy. Um, <clears throat> and also we had our Jolie Academy T-shirts. Thank you, Stephanie. And we had the sports bras. Tell them about the sports bras. Oh, yeah. When we gave them to them, they were a little bit embarrassed, um, but in a good way. They were kind of like, ooh, sports bras, because I don't think they've ever had one before, but it will help them. All the small things that we take for granted, I think, will help them yeah. a lot. And they were very happy to have us there. Um, but I, like I said before, I'm extremely proud of us um, yeah. for what we did. Um, and I said to Joe before, and I also said to my dad that I've done many things in my career, as, as has Joe. And I'd say this was like one of the highlights of anything I've ever done, if not the best thing I've ever done. Um, obviously winning the Champions League with Arsenal was amazing and all those other things. It's a different kind of emotion, but I think this was absolutely amazing. Yeah, I can only agree because just thinking about the amount of work that went into this, that Ingrid has helped us with, that Kristen has helped us with, that Talona and Alex and Stephanie, all of us together, um, we, we worked so hard in unison to get us to India today and we just have to thank you for giving us this opportunity because it was it was life-changing to say the least and uh, it was the hardest thing I've ever done but also uh, the most fulfilling thing that I have ever done so it was just everything was worth it I mean yeah I, I'm, I know this might sound cheesy but Joe was like a rock for me because I, I literally cried twice um, people that know me will know how sensitive I am to smell and we wasn't like, able to shower well when we was it would be cold the electricity would go out um, so, but it was all worth it. I mean, it sounds like we're, we're just going on. I feel like yeah. I'm just going on. But we do it all again if we had um, the drop of a hat because just to hear the girls smile and the laughs and everything that we that happened, I think it was amazing. And now Leanne's rocking a killer tan because we've been in Goa for a week with my family. <laughs> and she's really shedding her skin. She's peeling yeah, so like bad. Yeah, I'm like peeling all over. But um, And now we're in Kerala. But Goa was awesome. We got to lay on the beach for about a week eat a lot of food and sleep. The first night we went to bed at 7.45 at night, slept for 12 hours for the next four nights. Yeah, this is just exactly what we needed. I mean, we, uh, without sounding like a stuck record, we've been on the go for the last year or so. We went from straight from the WPS season into the Spanish season and kind of, we wouldn't want it any other way, but it's good sometimes to have a, a, have a break and kind of decompress and go again. And we'll yeah. start again February 3rd. Yeah, February 3rd. Which is a very special day, may I have to add? Someone's birthday! Someone's going to be 24. I don't want to be 24. I want to stay 23. I want to be 21 again. Uh, that's going to be hard. So do I. Not. Mm. Uh, Should we show them out where yeah, we were we'll show them a little bit of our hotel. Okay. Uh, we don't have time to show you the gym because it's just way too big. It's one 1964 treadmill and so a... This is the sun setting. That's um, where the crocodiles are. 
rusted weight machine. So, here's, so those are our friends. Show them our American friends from Chicago over here that lost their pet lizard that they caught in the hotel today, and the little girl was crying so much. Was yeah, so she was. Um, She's trying to protect it from the wind, maybe. That's a good point. Let's tell them, tell them about our, our favorite meal here so far. Ooh, we had snapper um, the other day. We had snapper and it was amazing. It's big fish, and they bring it out to you on the plate um, to, to show you what it looks like before you um, want to have it. And it was amazing. And we're going to show you the before and after pictures because before it was like this beautiful fish, and after 10 minutes, me and Joe, it was all gone, just a bone. Let's show them our pool. Okay, we're going to show you the pool. Very, uh, we were so happy because when we first arrived, there was like no one here. But now, uh, I think rumor has it that people have heard that Jolie Academy yeah, are here. Yeah, Jolie Academy are here. Once again, we got so much paparazzi. But here we are at the pool. This is where we laid most of the day. Um, these are the one. These are the 20 rooms they have around the hotel. And we're lucky enough to stay in one of them. It's getting pretty crazy around this time because everyone loves to watch the sunset. So. We should watch the sunset, so we should let them go. But we have a few important announcements to make. Um, I'm in the Witness Press program again, you can't see my head. But um, <laughs> we're having a Jolie Academy tweet up in Vancouver for the women's Olympic qualifying. So it's January 27th from 2 to 4, and everything is on our website. Um, Kristen and Ingrid are doing a great job of promoting it, and Talona is making the tickets. So she will actually be in attendance, Talona. So, Go meet Talona, go meet each other. I know you've only talked to each other on Twitter, so it'd be cool to actually see each other in person. Tweet up! And I'm sorry we won't be there, but we're there in spirit, and the money goes to a good cause, as you know. Our next trip, we're off to Chennai. Yes, Chennai. In three days. Uh, but we're, first, we're going to stay on a houseboat, then we're off to Chennai, then back to New Delhi to meet up with hopefully Hindu. Yeah, we'll meet up with the AIFF and have some pretty uh, plan our next trip. quality meetings to plan our next trip to India, and we also have to see the Taj Mahal. Can't leave India without seeing them. And we've already had great opportunities already to go somewhere else, and we're already working on the next thing. So, watch this space. Thank you so much for your help so far. We don't stop here. Um, this is India, January yeah. 2012. 2012. This is just the beginning. We miss you guys. Thank you for all your help, and thank you for allowing us to be here. And next time we do a video, it'll be on a houseboat. Yes. Oh, and Dean Ball. Dean Ball. We have 4,000. He's the guy guys. that got us to the 4,000 mark on our website. So. Thank you. Bye. Bye from India. Namaste. <laughs>